So hi dear Virgo, a very very good evening to you guys. This is Anjali Tarot and this is a last coffee cup oracle reading for all the Virgo Sun Moon Venus rising from today till the end of December 2023. I'm going to pull five cards for you guys and uh, like one uh, bottom of the deck and we will see what's coming your way by the end of this year 2023. And uh, if you want to be a professional tarot card reader like me, you can start your journey by purchasing my course. The link is in the description box for the same. If you want to start your self-love journey but you don't know from where to start and don't know what it is about, you can uh, like uh, start your self-love journey by purchasing my ebook and workbook. It's super cheap and it's loaded with a lot of information. You're going to get a lot of knowledge about self-love, trust me, okay? So you can buy it and start your journey. So let's start with your reading now, Virgo. The first message for Virgo people for this uh, remaining days of December 2023. We have the mountains, challenges, achievements. If you want great achievements in your life, you have to go through a lot of challenges. So it's like you will be able to go to the uh, like uh, top of the mountain, but you have to keep on reminding yourself that uh, top of one mountain is the bottom of the next actually. So you should understand that challenges are going to be a part of your life. If you are ready to face the challenges and the obstacles, the achievement is going to be yours. If, but if you are going to constant, continuously blame yourself and others and the situations or this and that, you will not be able to achieve that kind of uh, happiness or that kind of achievement that you are wanting in your life. So beware of that kind of energy. Challenges are going to be there. Plus achievement is also going to be there if you are not going to give up no matter what. Hmm? Now the second message that we have is a dog loyalty determination. If you have dogs around you, Virgo, you are some of the lucky souls because your dogs are like uh, grabbing all the negative energies, grabbing all the negative vibes from you and they're helping you to purify you, your, like, your energies, your aura. For others of you, I do see that someone is going to test your loyalty or you are going to test someone's loyalty here. You, It could be a love relationship area, it could be friendship, it could be siblings, it could be anything. But you are going to be in this energy of let me test this person's loyalty, how loyal they are to me. And you are going to be very determined like this person should be or this situation should uh, give me test if they want to be with me. Okay. For some of you, someone's loyalty towards you, someone's loyalty is going to make you uh, determined uh, make you very determined in your own energies that i should be like this person i should be like this energy they're quite loyal they're quite honest uh, so some kind of determination is going to be there from your side that's going to keep you in this energy of i should be like this hmm? very good the third message here is the tree stability growth i do see that you are doing a lot of lot of hard work from a very long time ago and this time you will start seeing the results of your hard work. This time you will be able to create a very solid and secure and safe base for yourself, especially for your career area where you will be able to see slow and steady growth. But you will be in this energy of finally growth is there. Finally, stability is coming. It's slow, it's slow and steady, but it's coming. So you are going to be in this energy of yeah, finally my results are my hard work is showing me results. Finally, something is happening that's giving me the growth. Okay, very good. Now, the fourth message that we have is the teeth, control and change. It's like you are trying to control each and every area of your life and you are in this energy of no matter what, I'm not going to let anything or anyone change me or change my way. It's like you are going to be in this energy of my way or highway kind of energy. All that's a very positive card to be honest with you guys. Virgo, for you people intuitively I'm getting, you are trying to control each and everything you're in your life and you're not ready to adapt with the changes that's happening according to time. So... <clears throat> until unless you you are going to release the control release the control and release this en energy of uh, uh, it's going to be my way or highway kind of thing you will not be able to find the like uh, find a flow in your life you yourself is resisting your own growth because you are not ready to change your way or you are not ready to go with the flow or you are not ready to adapt with the changes that's happening because again you can't control each and everything in your life not at all even if you think you can you can't honey now whoa the fifth message is the witch magic curse someone around you is trying to like put some kind of curse or magic or black magic kind of energy on you and it's actually going to hinder your progress if you are not going to raise your vibrations or change your vibrations or uplift in your vibrations according to the situation because someone around you doesn't want you to grow in your life most of the virgos out there are suffering from this kind of issues uh, the like the personal readings I'm doing these days are having lo like most of the Virgo people and they're suffering from these kind of issues negativity like a uh, uh, evil eye on black magic and all these things if you are going to keep yourself in high vibrations no evil eye no black magic nothing is going to work on your honey 
it's all about you keeping yourself in high vibrations and how to do that how to do that uh, do hope on upon one zero repetitions twice or thrice a day keep yourself protected meditate on the seven chakras that is also going to help you wear crystal bracelets black so black obsidian uh, tiger eye and black tourmaline these three you can uh, any one of these three you can wear and uh, like only wearing is not going to help you have to give that energy to that uh, like uh, crystal that yes it's helping me yes uh, yes i'm cleaning this crystal like every 15 days and it's like all about the intentions and whenever you feel something is like uh, drowning you something is keeping you in, in the low vibrations just remind yourself just me be mindful and remind yourself that i am sending this kind of energy back to the universe uh, so that it is going to transmute into white light and if uh, you uh, like uh, come as love to come as love like to me back to me i don't believe in uh, like uh, like sending negative energies to the sender this that this i don't believe in this shit i do believe in this kind of energy of okay if somebody is doing that uh, with us they are completely jealous of us they are some like low vibration person so we should raise our vibration we should be the biggest person big person here bigger person here and we should forgive and move ahead and bless them yeah the last message that we have is the shark survival power so universe is definitely going to put you through a lot of lot of uh, uh, heavy kind of test where you will be like what should i do what should i do what should i do but it's going to give you the power to get out of a situation and understand that you have the power to overcome anything in your life with your will power with your strength so thank you so much for tuning in virgo i'll see you soon in the next video bye bye take care god bless you namaste